Hi, it's Patrick Hutzel from IntensiveCareHotline.com with another quick tip for families in intensive care. Today's tip is about is there something such as unweanable from a ventilator in intensive care? Now, this is a question we're getting more and more frequently and because ICU teams are telling families in intensive care that their loved ones in intensive care are unweanable some LTACs in the US also tell families in ICU or in LTAC that their loved ones are quote unquote unweanable. Now because this has been such a big uh, question we've been getting lately, I did actually a YouTube live stream last week uh, about this topic, about a, a client's question. You know, my mom is in intensive care and the ICU team told me she's unweanable. And I made a live stream about that so that people could ask uh, questions on the live stream and you can check it out by clicking on the link below this video where I link to the live stream from from last week. Now this also became a very popular video very quickly. It had over a hundred views within a few days of me publishing it and we had quite a number of people on the live stream. And just uh, for the records I do YouTube live streams once a week usually on a Saturday night at 8.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time in the US which is 10.30 a.m. Sydney Melbourne time in Australia on a Sunday. Coming back to our topic, is there something such as unweanable? No, there isn't. There is the exception to the rule. The exception to the rule is for patients that had a C1, C2 spinal injury or motor neuron disease, ALS, amyotrophic lateral sclerosis and a few other rare neurological conditions, but they are the exception to the rule. Every other condition in intensive care with the right skill set, right? and with the right determination and with the right mindset many patients in intensive care can be weaned off the ventilator either with a breathing tube or with a tracheostomy. If they can't be weaned off the breathing tube or the endotracheal tube they might need a tracheostomy and then the next step is to wean them off the tracheostomy. If God forbid on the rare exception where people can't be weaned off the ventilator with a tracheostomy or it takes long periods of time we're talking months, weeks or years even, then you should look at services such as intensive care at home. Go to go and check out intensivecareathome.com. So go and watch the live stream, go and check out intensivecareathome.com. If you have a loved one in intensive care, go to intensivecarehotline.com, call us on one of the numbers on the top of our website or send us an email to support at intensivecarehotline.com. Uh, also, have a look at our membership for families in intensive care at intensivecaresupport.org. And if you need a medical record review for your loved one while they're in intensive care or after intensive care, you can contact us as well. Share this video with your friends and family. Give it a, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my YouTube channel for regular updates for families in intensive care. Click the notification bell. Thanks for watching. This is Patrick Hutzel from IntensiveCareHotline.com and I will talk to you in a few days.